Developing tonight, a nightmare in a grocery store in Berwyn this morning. That's when a good Samaritan was stabbed to death as he was trying to stop a man who was attacking a girl and her mother. WGN's Gaynor Hall is in Berwyn tonight with more on the story. Gaynor. Ray and Micah, the Good Samaritan, identified as Umberto Guzman, 32 years old. The police chief here calling him a true hero. Relatives say Umberto Guzman was a lovable husband and a new dad. His daughter, just about six months old. He worked for Vintners and was making a delivery at the store when he tried to stop the attack and lost his life. It was just really crazy, like a lot of commotion, like cops everywhere, people coming in and out. A deadly scene unfolding after 10 o'clock this morning at Valier's Produce in Berwyn. Police say it started with a 14-year-old girl asking her mother, who was working as a cashier, the price of a bottle of water. That's when a male customer accused her of trying to cut into the checkout line. He attacked her, punching the girl several times in the face. When her mother tried to intervene, he attacked her too. The Good Samaritan tried to protect the mother and daughter, getting in between them and the suspect. Police say the suspect started walking towards the exit, then stopped and turned back, pulling out a knife and stabbing Guzman multiple times in the chest and torso. He died from his injuries. The suspect took off running and a second Good Samaritan tried to stop him, but he also stabbed that person whose injuries are not life threatening. Berwyn police officers responding spotted the suspect jumping a fence a couple of blocks from the grocery store. And when they entered the yard, they saw him sitting in a chair. They took him into custody. People at businesses nearby in disbelief tonight. It's sad at this day and age that it's, it's becoming more and more common that we're getting a lot of crime everywhere. I feel really unsafe, like just walking out of here, going to the store. Like I said, I go there almost every day when I'm here. And like to know that, you know, there's actually people out there who just could just punch on a little girl and they're his mom. And they're praising the Good Samaritans who stepped in to help. They are truly heroes. I mean, when you step, you know, if you see something happening, especially to a female, and you, you step in to help out. But it's unfortunate that one person had to lose their life. The second Good Samaritan was expected to be released from the hospital today. Charges still pending against the suspect. Reporting live from Berwyn, Gaynor Hall, WGN News. Thank you, Gaynor. Also, 